Good morning. Good morning. Zoe, good morning. Twinkle. 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 Little star. I decided that we are vlogging today. I also decided that I'm taking a social media break today. So I deleted my Instagram app. I also want to focus on school today. I wrote an Instagram post yesterday. If you want to follow me, it's right here. And it's about all the things that I'm working on my goals and my progress towards my goals and i failed to mention in that caption that i'm also working on my bachelor's degree my bachelor's degree and i need to take a day to focus on my homework because my attention has been spread very thin across many different things so today homework day and vlogging day let's go zoe i'm stuck you're stuck every morning i like to open my blinds and let the light in Happy for my plant. Happy for my plant and for me. One second, okay? Happy you. you want me to help you? Help. Okay. Zoe wants me to help her. What are we doing? Okay. Just made my bed. It's something that I do every single day. I don't feel okay if I don't. There's a basket of laundry over there. Maybe we'll get to it today, maybe we won't. So went downstairs and grabbed Zoe some snacks. So if you didn't know, Zoe and I are vegan and here's some snacks that I like to get mainly for her, but I'd be lying if I said I didn't grab some sometimes. The one she's eating right now, here's bakery brownie, not sponsored, double chocolate, Canadian bakery oatmeal crumble, the strawberry flavor. These are so good. My non-vegan friend Leilani said they're really good so take it from her if not from me blueberry version it's like the fig bar kind zoe likes those small tube of ritz up here something that i like to do actually the night before not necessarily in the morning is i like to go to my planner and plan out my day in advance so that i can sleep on it, it helps my brain it helps me sleep better it helps me feel more organized if i'm planning my day the night before and deciding what I'm gonna take my time to do. Can you please um, not do that? No, Every day, no matter how busy I feel that I am, I try to have some like focused time with Zoe or I give her my undivided attention. This doesn't count because I'm talking to you guys, but we were just working on this puzzle and I'm feeling like I wanna go downstairs and make some coffee because she just uh, ripped a puzzle piece in half and it's too early for quite possibly one of the most important parts of the day. It's time to go on a walk. I've been usually going on walks two to three times a day. If you don't know, I recently quit vaping. And so that has been my replacement habit is exercising and going on walks. So we had breakfast, as you saw. I made myself a little coffee, as you can see. I've been drinking coffee less, but I feel very tired and irritable, honestly, this morning. So it's about that time. It's pretty cold and gloomy outside today. Hence my, this situation. And I'm gonna get Zoe's jacket on. I literally turned on Coco Melon in the loft just so that I could have the free moment to record this. Whether you're quitting vaping or not, going on walks always makes me feel better.
favorite podcasts. One of them, Don't Keep Your Day Job by Kathy Heller. If you want to hear more of my favorite podcasts, I'll link that video down below. That walk was really good. I'm sweating under this fleece. I'm ready to go inside. In case you were curious, I let Zoe watch TV while I'm doing my homework and then eventually she starts to come in here and check on me and I know at that point she's getting a little restless so I'm actually going to wrap up my homework. Nothing is due today but I just needed to work on stuff that's due on Sunday two days from now and I'm going to do a little bit of writing for a personal project that I have and then I will stop working on the computer so that Zoe can have some more of my attention. A little bit later now, I'm gonna take care of this basket of laundry that's by my bed that you guys saw earlier while Zoe's occupied. We did our best. I don't know about you guys, but I freaking hate matching socks. I hate mismatched socks. It's always the last thing that I do. Hey! Hey! It is time for our second walk of the day. Uh, feeling pretty good. We just had that lunch, kind of a big lunch as you guys saw. And I think that Zoe is gonna take a nap. She actually usually does end up falling asleep on our second walk of the day. And then I have that stretch of time to do whatever I choose. Usually it's work, try to be very productive in that time, but today, I completed my to-do list early and I want to use that time to just do some self-care. I think I want to paint my nails. Self-care isn't always just painting your nails, obviously, but my nails need some love. Hey guys, we're back from our walk now. Zoe is sleeping. I think I'm going to paint my nails this color. Glad I got to get that done. I'm sure like other moms can relate with like the anxiety of someone else like waking up your baby. Like you try so, so hard to get your baby to sleep and then you let the necessary people know like, hey, baby is asleep. Don't do anything to threaten this opportunity for me. And then, you know, they start threatening the opportunity and then you have to go downstairs and they're painting your nails and be like, stop slamming the door. Hey you guys, we're about to go on our third walk of the day because let's be honest, her and I both need it. Last walk complete. I'm feeling better. <laughs> so it looks pretty zen. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Turn on your post notifications so you don't miss our next one. Oh.